everyone, thanks for tuning in again. Nate with 911 Rapid Response. Today's vehicle showcase, we have for you two of 34 vehicles for the City of Scranton Police Department in Lackawanna County. So a very large pro project that we have going on for them. Maybe you've stopped by our Facebook page and seen these uh, showcased there, uh, showing off the Wheelan cloud system that we have installed with their CENCOM core system. Go over that a little bit more in detail as we cruise along the video, but we'll start at the front of the vehicles with the aftermarket equipment that we've added. So we have the Weston Elite push bumper, and this is going to integrate two wheel and ions in that top rail. Different options with that Weston push bumper. You can add two, four, or no lights in that top channel. Also on the front bumper, where the retail model Explorer would have fog lights, we have surface mounted two wheel and T ions and then wheel and T-ions on each side of the push bumper. Front corner in the OEM location, we have a hideaway there, wheel and vertex, it's a duo red blue. And our main piece of warning on these vehicles is going to be the 54 inch wheel and Senator light bar, duo model, so we'll get full white function across the front and the sides and amber function in the rear, the side of the primary red and blue warning. Side rear warning, we have a wheel and strip light plus in the rear cargo window, mounted on the top side. And while we're here, we can take a look at the antenna for the wheel and cloud system. So that wheel and cloud system is going to allow this end user to push out updates to their vehicles with program firmware updates for the CENCOM core systems. Also gonna give them a large amount of fleet control um, for each one of their vehicles. So a really neat, really neat item that we have added here and um, really makes the, the fleet solution uh, very nice for the end user. Kind of all brings it all into one place together. You can get more information on that um, on the Wheelan website. Surface mounted on the rear hatch, two Wheelan T-ions, we're also flashing the LED portion of the taillights. We've got a OPS storage solution in the rear, just a single drawer unit, key locking. And this is going to be on, I'd say, about a 12 inch bracket. So different brackets available for these drawer systems, allowing for cargo storage underneath the, underneath the box as well. So it's a simple simple operation with the latch, very smooth operation as well, aluminum construction. We've also mounted a small fire extinguisher on the top side for this customer. Interior side of the hatch, we've got red, white compartment lights. And those lights will have hands-free function if they're left on with a mercury switch that we've included in the rear hatch. And also hands-free when the hatch goes up, blocking the rear of the light bar, we've got two more wheel and T-ions. Uh, mounted on the hatch trim interior side. Uh, one more thing to mention, there is also a stick light in the back window, but we have that disabled in a park feature. ProGuard prisoner containment solution, front recess panel, poly sliding window. This has the outboard seat belts. Uh, so Seat belts fastened on the front partition and are secured on the outside of the seat uh, for officer safety, easy loading, simple, simple cinch of the belt and you're good to go. The plastic seat, easy to clean, also provides a lower loading height when, uh, when you know, loading transportees in and out of the vehicle. And that's also paired with the cargo, uh, the cargo barrier with the poly window. Doors are fitted with the poly window barriers. And up front, we've got a Havis vehicle specific console solution. This is gonna be the high angled console, providing them the brother pocket jet 
internal mount here. So pocket jet printer gets mounted inside here. Printer paper feeds out. Easy open there. That'll kind of show you how the printer and the paper gets mounted inside there when it needs changed out. Sencom core control head. This is the rotary knob and slide. Eight programmable push buttons across the top. Two customer supplied radios. We've got uh, USB charging, 12 volt charging there. Cup holders, and we've got a pair of Santa Cruz gun locks, the universal XL cuff mounted in the recess panel area of that partition. Also provided this client with a computer mounting solution, also by Havis. This is going to be a top mount locking, swing away, slide out. So we get a lot, a lot of articulation there and um, don't have to worry about that moving around because it'll lock into place once it's pushed away or pulled forward. And also installed for this client is their Axon camera system. 911 rapid response just recently became an approved installer for Axon camera systems. So we can handle those needs for you here. So we'll take a look at some functionality that we have. Again, this vehicle is in a park mode right now. Slide three, vehicle in park. Uh, daytime flash, so we'll get photo cell operation out of the light bar for ambient light. So in nighttime, it'll automatically go into a nighttime mode, whether it's in park or uh, in a response mode. Out of park in a priority response. We also have a preemption module installed in the center portion of that light bar so we will get uh, strobe preemption function which can be manually disabled into park automatically cutting our white flash and taking the preemption out of the equation takedown function alley function vehicle is also equipped with a howler uh, won't blow our cameraman away here with that but uh, we'll go ahead and go into a low power mode might get a little bit of flicker out of this because of the frame rate of the camera but this is going to give us a DVI pattern in our park setting only and uh, obviously we have our traffic advisor functions and that'll wrap up this showcase folks thanks for tuning along or thanks for following along tuning into our channel for another vehicle showcase Again, large vehicle project here, so you might see more of this on our social media pages. Stay tuned for more. We'll see you next time.